Hello guys, welcome back to another video. We'll do another video on FNAF Help Wanted. So, let's get started. Look at this guy. He's so annoying. Get closer and closer each day. Get all these. Finish these. Definitely gonna need some jump scares here. Welcome back to Parts and Service. It looks like one of our guests left a personal item on our star attraction. Let's return it to the lost and found. Carefully, grab and remove the child's hat from Freddy's mouth. Freddy's got a pretty good hold of it. Give it another firm tug. Good job. Now place the hat in the lost and found bin on your right. While we're at it, let's make sure there isn't anything else stuck inside. To access Freddy's chest cavity, grab Freddy's bow tie and pull it outwards. Well done. Freddy's chest cavity is now open. Remove the child's watch and place it in the lost and found bin. Be careful not to touch any of Freddy's sensitive wiring. Hit my too close to my desk. Okay, it fixed my boundary. Let's try this again. Oh, I clicked, I clicked, I clicked the wrong button. I didn't. I I got the watch out. But I didn't touch anything. Welcome back to Parts and Service. It looks like one of our guests left a personal item on our star attraction. Let's return it to the lost and found. Carefully grab and remove the child's hat from Freddy's mouth. Freddy's got a good job. Now place the hat in the lost and found. While we're at it, let's make sure there isn't anything else stuck inside. To access Freddy's chest cavity, grab Freddy's bow tie and pull it outwards. Well done. Freddy's chest cavity is now open. Remove the child's watch and place it in the lost and found bin. That. Be careful not to touch any of Freddy's sensitive wiring. back let me good job it appears there is a child's shoe wedged behind Freddy's music box the music box must be removed before you can access the child's shoe. Gently grasp the music box and extract it from Freddy's chest cavity before the safety latch descends. Oh. 
Oh, I just lagged. Carefully, place the music box on the work table to your left. Great job. To reset the safety latch, press the button located on Freddy's endoskeleton. Now, remove the child's shoe and place it in the lost and found bin. Well done. Return the music box to Freddy's chest cavity and we'll call it a day. Oh no, you seem to have mishandled Freddy's music box. This is not good. A replacement may be found on the work table. A slow and even pace is recommended. Crisis averted. To close Freddy's chest cavity, press the large black button on the center of Freddy's face. That concludes your time in parts and service. Your pay will be docked accordingly. Bluetooth connection. There could be a, a coin or something in that room. Time for this guy.
Welcome back to Parts and Service. Foxy has been out of... Oh no. It looks like Foxy's proprietary servo motors are malfunctioning. It is recommended that you keep an eye on Foxy at all times. You will need to place new control fuses in the exposed receptacles to continue. Retrieve the fuse from drawer number one that matches Foxy's leg receptacle. To avoid bodily harm, wait for Foxy's legs to stop moving before inserting the control fuse. Good job. Foxy has regained control of his legs. A gentle reminder, it is recommended that you keep an eye on Foxy at all times. I, um, I'll try. Oh no. It looks like a former employee attempted to repair Foxy's chest motor using an incorrect fuse. Carefully, remove the incorrect fuse from Foxy's oh, chest kidding? and insert it into Foxy's upper arm receptacle. The remaining chest fuses are located in drawers number two and number four. Fix both fuses to continue. Number four. His chest. Red, blue, and green. Positive to negative. Good job. Retrieve Foxy's eye from drawer number three. When Foxy's eye patch is fully open, place the eye back into his eye socket. Well done. This concludes all your parts yes. and service tasks. Pilot Ow. Cove can now Ow. be reopened. Ow. Please go away. Bye. Get me out of this. Go, 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 go. Using proprietary technology developed by Fazbear Entertainment, our VR development teams were able to use vintage control boards almost like plug and play, digitally recreating performances and personalities from the past in an instant. Okay, we finished parts and service. You know what? Let's go here. Here, check all our this domain. I think this is the what Jeremy complained of nightmares when he came in this morning. He wasn't talking about oh, it. This way. You can always tell when a company is getting ready to fire someone, they start giving out written warnings for silly things, making sure to build a paper trail and make a case for a firing. Things that normally no one would care about suddenly become grave offenses, all worthy of being written and documented. I guess it works two ways, because it also encourages a person to quit rather than be scrutinized so heavily. Mm -hmm. I think Jeremy was too far gone to consider that option, though. The thing about it is that I don't think they were going to fire him because of anything he was doing wrong. They just knew he'd seen something. They needed to discredit him. So, 
this tape is talking about how William knows he found something. Why not? William's in hell. Somebody knows about it. Doesn't want them to find it out. But let's go back to this. You only have six coins. Oh, we got the. Oh. You. Do that. Anything missing? I suppose if those ones get sold. I know there's more I could get. Hey, if you guys made it this far, thank you. Please like and um, if you guys want to, you can like and comment. I mean, like and subscribe. Turn to menu. Okay, in the next video, you guys want me to finish this, or do you want me to start this? This will be after FNAF 2. Those guys are finished. To finish, I'm gonna hate this. Especially hate this. Do I know? Either finish FNAF 1 or start FNAF 2. Please tell me in the description. Oh, that. oh, my game's completely breaking. And I'll see you guys next time.